Hello everyone, I am Advocate Akhil Solanki, associate with Dial Easy. So in this video, we are going to discuss about the POXO. So the government has introduced a unique legislation, uh, the POXO Act 2012, the, uh, to address sexual assault and children exploitation. So the uh, ever mentioned act punishes all recognized uh, cases of sexual abuse of minors uh, severely while taking the seriousness of the offence into consideration. So to guarantee the justice is upheld, the act is being implemented in a different way. The sufferer <coughs> must uh, the uh, must undergo the medical examination with the least amount of discomfort. The POXO Amendment Act 2019 was also passed to strengthen penalties uh, all the way up to death sentence and to stop the use of child pornography. So unfortunately the modification appears arbitrary and ambiguous. Uh, so <coughs> as categorization that is unjustified and in violation of section 14 of constitution is provided by section 42 of the POXO Act which was added by POXO Amendment Act 2019. So the phrase equal protection of law is found in Article 14. Uh, class leg legislation is forbidden, but it is okay to classify people or object in a sensible way. So <coughs> two requirements mu must be met in, in order to pass the test of permitted categorization, which is the categorization must be based on an un understandable difference that separates those in the group from those who are excluded. So according to section 34 of the act, any youngster suspected of committing a heinous crime would be considered as an adult for the purpose of the law and will face severe punishment. So it is unacceptable to classify the accused as a youngster under the juvenile act. Uh, but because of their age, this misconception under section 34 must be changed in a way that advances the court's goal and ensures that the appropriate individual receives justice. So it is concluded that even if the legislation is effective and good, loopholes can be still be made. The POXO Act is a comprehensive Everybody piece of legislation designed to safeguard children against exploitation and sexual abuse. So thank you, see you in the next video with some more information.